you know, as the sets progressed, Jesper would call on the phone and say, hi, I've got a list, pick the ones you want. And I started taking, making a habit of picking ones that did not bring something immediately to mind, that weren't obvious. We're going to do Tuck Near Deathlock. What? <laughs> and I said, okay, that one I'm going to need a little bit of a help with. He said, think Necromancer. And that was the whole art direction I had. And that was fine. And I ended up doing it mixed media. It wasn't even a painting because that was where I could, that was where the images in my mind came to. So it was part ink drawing, part chalk, part, you know, there were painted bits in it. Um, you know, Mind Warp was on a weird paper because the first one I did was kind of like Tuckneer in the sense that it was on a, 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 a colored paper and he said this isn't vibrant enough and so I went out uh, to the art store and I literally bought you know a sheet of the uh, bookend paper and then I painted on top of that so that kind of thing you know, let me learn and experiment and push the envelope a lot.